Good morning, brothers and sisters. Brother Paul with the Universal Peace Officers. Doing a little walking grounded with God today at the uh, National Park that commemorates the birthplace of Abraham Lincoln here in Kentucky. And I'm just reflecting on all the men and women who have put their lives in service for our country and have done things that at the time they probably didn't realize what they were doing. But when we look back and you see all the historical figures and, the, you know, Lincoln and Daniel Boone or two that I've visited their grave sites while I was here in Kentucky and it got me just reflecting on the sacrifices and the things that people did and they didn't even really realize what they were doing. And, you know, as I look around at the world today, there's so much chaos and division and uncertainty and mistruths and lies and dif disinformation, but they're also is the peace and the hope and the foundation of our Judeo-Christian principles that founded our country that I am hopeful and confident that God has inspired enough men and women to continue to fight for our freedom and for our way of life and to stand up for God's truth and love one another and love themselves, love God and be part of the process to help us to stand for the freedoms and the way of life that has been established by the founding fathers of our country who were, in my opinion, inspired by God to provide us an opportunity to live as free people and to love one another and to realize we're all created equal in the image of God, all of us. We're all his kids. So anything we can do to encourage and remind people that we're all together in this and we've got to stick together and we can't let... Whatever forces of evil that are above everything that's creating this chaos and this darkness, we need to stand together for love and for truth and be light bearers and be beacons and continue to uh, just stand up for our, our way of life, stand up for our constitution, stand up for our beliefs in the Judeo-Christian principles our country was founded on, and just make sure we take time to get grounded, get centered, get to where we're at peace with God, peace with ourselves so we can be at peace with other people you know where the spirit of the lord is there's freedom and the spirit of the lord is freedom so spend time guys getting close getting connected and uh asking god to inspire you and how he can use you and the gifts he's given you to continue to help to love one another and to fight for the cause god fill us all with peace love and compassion god bless america peace officers out